Hey friends, I am looking so forward to our study of the domestic monastery. And I'm uh, recording this video right outside the Mayo Clinic Hospital. And this place has, over the last couple of years at various times, become a monastery of sorts for me. A separated place, a, a place where I met with God in incredibly deep ways. And, and I share that with you because what we're gonna be looking at is a reality that a monastery isn't just simply a place that's out away from everything, but it can be any place. So I'm looking forward to our time of study together. So we start meeting on Monday the 14th, and we're gonna walk through chapters one through three, then the following week chapters four through seven, and the final week chapters eight through 10. Now the book is actually um, quite simple. It's not a hard read, but it's a deep and profound read. So I want to encourage you as you're reading to read it slowly, to read it prayerfully, to read it reflectively, to read it with the Lord. And when we get together each time, we're going to do uh, several things, but it's going to be centered around two things that I'm going to ask you to bring. The first one is from each chapter, bring an insight. And then secondly, bring an invitation. An insight, something that has impacted you, something that stood out, and then an invitation that you are sensing from the Lord as you read that chapter. So really those simple, two simple things for each chapter, and we'll start on Monday the 14th with chapters 1 through 3. See you then.